Happy Market Data Monday. I'm Harris Benson, founder of Benson Analytics and Realtor with Douglas Elman Real Estate here in Houston, Texas. A big theme of real estate in 2020 had to do with the tightening of inventory levels and thus resulting in a more competitive marketplace. Today, I'm going to be looking at the cities of Houston, Austin, Dallas-Fort Worth, as well as San Antonio and the major counties of each city to see how inventory levels compare throughout. Beyond price, a great way to capture the pulse of a market, no matter what real estate market you're looking at, is to look at the inventory levels and more specifically the monthly inventory levels of that marketplace. Of course, I always recommend that you dive a little bit deeper into the market area that you're looking at, but from a high level, this will give you a good idea of two indicators. One, how competitive a marketplace is, and two, who has the upper hand? So is that buyers or is that sellers who have the upper hand in that particular market? On the screen here, you should be looking at the four major cities I mentioned before. So that's Houston, Austin, Dallas-Fort Worth, as well as San Antonio, and the main county, or at least one of the main counties of that city, which the data was pulled from, comparing those market uh, inventory levels. And when looking at the information year over year, so it's year to date through I believe November of 2020 compared to the same period of 2019. It's no surprise that inventory levels are lower uh, year over year. However, what's really staggering is when you look at the city of Austin, more specifically the county of Travis, so Travis County in Austin, and comparing that to, uh, let's say, Houston or Harris County. So Harris County dropped to a level of 2.2 months of inventory. However, comparing that to Austin, which is at 0.6 months of inventory, it's extremely eye-opening to see how much lower of a number that is. So for those of you who don't really understand what inventory levels uh, really means, what it really means is that uh, in Austin's uh, standpoint, so 0.6 months of inventory, so that means if no new listings hit the marketplace based on the pace of sales the last 12, 12 months, that all uh, homes available on the marketplace, in this instance, single family homes, it would take only just over half a month for all those homes to sell. So that's a very low number. And uh, especially this year, I will be looking at inventory levels to give me an idea of how the spring and summer market will be not only in Houston, but throughout the other cities uh, throughout Texas. Now, if you have any questions at all about the housing market uh, throughout Texas, especially when it comes to Houston, Texas, please reach out. I'll be happy to answer any questions that you might have. Once again, I'm Harris Benson, founder of Benson Analytics and Realtor with Douglas Allman Real Estate here in Houston, Texas. I hope you have a great week and take care. Bye.